Listen and read. The hare and the tortoise. One day, a hare was walking in the forest when he saw a tortoise. The hare was the fastest animal in the forest. The tortoise was the slowest animal in the forest. The hare called out to the tortoise, "Hurry up! You're so slow. Can't you walk faster?" Can't you run? The tortoise felt angry and said to the hare, "Why don't we have a race? Maybe I can win." The hare laughed and laughed. "Sure, I will win," the hare said. They agreed to start next to a big tree and finish at the river. Then they called their friends to watch. The hare stood beside the tortoise, and the race began. Listen and read. The hare said to himself, "The tortoise is very far behind. I can't see the finish line. I have time for a nap." Soon, the hare was asleep under a tree next to the path. The tortoise walked steadily on and on. He didn't stop. Soon he passed the sleeping hare. The hare slept for an hour. When he finally woke up, he looked at the finish line. He couldn't believe his eyes. Tortoise was almost at the finish line. The hare ran as fast as he could, but it was too late. The tortoise crossed the finish line and won the competition. The hare was furious. The tortoise looked back at the hare and smiled. Then he said, "Slow but steady wins the race." Drag the pictures and arrange them according to the story. Read the sentences. Complete the questions. Where was the hare walking? What did the hare see? How was the tortoise walking? Where did they start their race? Who went to sleep? How long did he sleep? When did the hare wake up? Who won the race? Read the sentences. 
Which animal is each sentence about? Right. Hair. Tortoise. Hair. Tortoise. Hair. Group work. What does slow but steady wins the race mean? Drag the correct word to the planks. Match the words in column A with the words with similar meaning in column B. Let's see an example. I am not happy. I am glad. Happy and glad mean the same. Language focus. Quotation marks. We use quotation marks to show what someone said. We put quotation marks at the beginning and the end of the person's words. Use a comma before or after quotation marks. Start the first word inside the quotation marks with a capital letter. The hare said, I am the fastest animal. I am the slowest animal, said the tortoise. Read the sentences. I like fish. I don't like fish. I like seashells. Let's see how to use quotation marks. Tinka says, I like fish. Tuna says, I don't like fish. I like... We use comma before the quotation marks. First letter must be capital after the beginning of quotation mark. Punctuation is used before closing the quotation mark. Remember, we use quotation marks in our writing to show that someone is speaking. The teacher asks, What is your name? The student replied, My name is Shagor, not. The teacher asks, What is your name? The student replied, My name is Shagor. Underline the sentences with quotation marks on your textbook, pages 54 and 55.